These days we're no strangers to bad air quality in Montana, especially during fire season. But you may not be familiar with what those air quality levels mean, so we're breaking it down for you. That bright little color green is good. Your air is satisfactory. Below that, yellow means that uh, ex it's acceptable air quality. Orange, a little bit worse. Members of sensitive groups may experience health effects. Things get a little more dangerous when we reach the unhealthy red color. That indicates some members of the general public could experience health effects. And purple is very unhealthy, and a health alert at that. Everyone is at risk of being impacted by what's in the air. Lastly, hazardous. Once air quality reaches maroon, everyone is more likely to be affected. It's also a health warning of emergency conditions. And since we're talking about the health impacts, let's go to MTN's Sean Wells, who tells us more about the medical side. Unhealthy smoke has invaded northwest Montana, causing irritations for those spending prolonged time outdoors. This type of Air quality impacts us from the tip of our nose all the way down into our lungs. Logan Health pulmonary and critical care doctor Sue Fessler says unhealthy air quality can cause serious issues for those with underlying health conditions. Even normal healthy people will feel the impacts of this type of air quality and I think we need to pay attention to that and and tailor your activities accordingly. Dr. Fessler says smoke particles irritate the linings of our lungs, leading to shortness of breath. That irritation leads to excess mucus production and, uh, and for, like I said, those people sensitive to it, like with asthma, they'll notice that their airways will become tighter and make it harder for them to breathe. Dr. Fessler recommends those spending prolonged time outdoors to purchase an N95 mask, which filters out harmful smoke particles. And for anyone who's working outside, um, where they have to be out breathing this air for sustained periods of time, I think wearing a, a respirator or an N95 mask is a good idea if you can. Obviously it's hot and it's not always that comfortable, but it will will probably in the long run make your breathing easier that day. In Kalispell, Sean Wells, MTA News.